I'm ready. And then I dropped my phone. Previously on Clarified Creations. Second day of classes and already two evacuations, so that's very exciting, if you want to put it that way. I'm just really tired and want to go back to sleep. Good morning, Clarified Creations family. It is 6.44 in the morning, and I hope that you guys saw my last couple clips. I tried to get a couple on my phone. I didn't have my vlog camera because it was one in the morning and I just was not awake for any of it, really. Isabel, my roommate, had to wake me up and tell me that it was a fire alarm, not her alarm clock. I was so tired. <laughs> it was 1.14 and the fire alarm went off and then maybe t uh, we went outside and no one told us anything. 10 minutes later, they're like, okay, you can go back inside. The smoke was still there and the smell was downstairs and we get into our room and the fire alarm keeps going off and the lights are off but like the actual alarm didn't do anything but the beeping sounds kept going I'm like well this is a little bit inconvenient but we're gonna go back to sleep because they said it was okay so 10 minutes later off to sleep but wait there's more the intercom came on and they said that the second and third floors were still really smoky, so they had us evacuate for the second time. And that time took a little longer, it took 30 minutes to stay out there, and then they finally gave us the all clear. We got back in around 2.15, so one hour of sleep was lost, and I definitely feel it. I'm sure everybody else does this morning. So I did have my coffee, and it only helped a little bit because I'm still super tired, super tired, and I have an 8.10 in the morning a.m. class, so. Hopefully that goes well, and just try and keep positive, and hopefully there won't be any more fires in the near future at all. So, that was just the little backstory behind the whole fire alarm last night. I hope it was entertaining to watch, and I will see you, um, maybe at breakfast, I'm not sure. I have two classes this morning, and then I'll update you guys throughout my day, so keep watching. Hopefully no more fire alarms. Good morning everyone. We're having coffee for the first time. I just woke up so I'm in my volunteer pajamas supporting my school. We got it for eight dollars if you were wondering. Pretty good deal. And now there's coffee. Hopefully. Oh there it is. Um, I'm gonna go try it. Today I'm going to be doing laundry for the first time and as you can see I have a bunch of laundry to do and then over here the second one is my towel or not my towel how silly am I it's my Betty's blanket wow the lighting's terrible I am very hot so that's why my face is red we just went outside and walked around campus for about an hour so it's pretty hot out since it's the summer and yeah, first time doing laundry. I definitely feel like a college student now. I'm not sure how much of this I'm going to get to blog because there's a lot of people that have been coming in and I'm, currently there's no one here, so thank goodness for that. Um, but I will update you if I can on the laundry process. Nothing bad has happened yet. No, nothing has shrunk or anything, so that's good. See you later. A little update on the progress of the first time doing laundry. It is super crowded, so note to self, don't do laundry in the middle, middle of the day on a Sunday. Everybody seems to be doing it. And my blanket, after three tries, it is still not dry, so my roommate, Isabel, she recommended I put it up on the hanger, so, not a hanger, the closet rod, and hopefully it'll dry that way. And then next off, we're gonna do another load of laundry. I'm waiting on that to dry. And afterwards, I'll fold it and it'll be done. So it wasn't too bad, just a lot of waiting. This is our after the torch bears night. It's pouring down rain. <laughs> and we're walking in the rain. Would you like to say hi? Hi. Hi. <laughs> Fashionably. <laughs> Fashionable umbrella solutions. We got these beautiful, luxurious packs. 
that also make for really good umbrellas. And then I dropped my phone. This has been one interesting week, so to make sure to click subscribe. Woo! I got that on video, finally. And don't forget to join the Clarify Creations family because you never know what's gonna go on at college here at UT. So, Tennessee weather. We're going to the Honors Convocation now and my shoe situation is high heels. And as you know from earlier, I did a really stupid thing and decided to walk four miles in shower flip-flops and I do have blisters on my feet. So that's going to be an interesting adventure walking <laughs> the next maybe mile, mile and a half, or I could be exaggerating, uh, to the student union. 15 minute walk so in hopefully the 100 degree heat <laughs> there's Isabel dressed and ready for honors convocation not sword not sword hey guys in the middle of a rainstorm thundering and lightning woohoo what a great time to be alone it's going to pour in a minute I don't want my roommate to walk by herself. It's all good. I'm just soaked. That's okay though. It'll be fine. Just a little rainy. It's nice and refreshing, so it's not super hot. That's nice. But other than that, I'm not a huge fan of the lightning and thunder. But you know, you gotta do. You gotta walk. It'll be fine. Stay tuned for more weather adventures with Claire and Five Creations. I'm ready. I love rain. This is so much fun. Okay, so we made a quick little stop at our dorm because it's raining and we both forgot to pack umbrellas, which are kind of important. And of course now it stopped raining, so I'm just gonna pack my umbrella anyways, and then we're gonna head back to chemistry. So, see you after chemistry. As you can see, I am once again back at the dorm. I finished my chemistry lecture, and after that I made it to the Ag Campus in 19 minutes and 45 seconds, which I think is pretty good because most people it takes about 30 minutes at least to get from one end of campus to the other, so after that, after that I ate lunch with my dad, and afterwards we rode the bus and I got dropped off at the ball shop to go and purchase, yet again, more school supplies. Oh, I love it. I got two of these TI-30 XIIS calculators, $17 each there, only eight bucks on Amazon. But what can you do when you have to have the calculator by Friday and Amazon won't deliver it until Monday? So now I'm, I'm just back here. I'm going to rest for a while and then start on my ever daunting list of things to do, including all my homework. I have a lot of homework now. So I'm going to get at it and I'll see you guys a little later. And I'm back in the dorm room again with little cruise but this was just the first few days of college the first three so much has happened i had a biology lecture a calculus class which is going pretty good and now i'm just gonna head home for the weekend and maybe get some more homework done and spend some time with family so i really hope that you guys enjoyed this vlog and if you did please give it a big thumbs up because i have a lot more planned as well and i'm super excited about sharing them with you guys and i can't wait to hear what you have to say in the comments about college in general i hope you have a good day bye